I want some dirt friends in my house. What, how, how should I set them up? As far as if you're going for something like as a display piece, I would suggest anything from a five to a 10 gallon tank, mm -hmm. about halfway filled with substrate, put a whole bunch of leaf litter, some botanicals and some uh, cork bark on top. Really, really simple. We actually don't change out the substrate uh, as they break it down because they're literally eating their substrate. That's their main source of food is that it'll start to compact into like almost a compost. Mm. And then it actually holds your burrows better. So you just keep adding substrates. And then as far as cares, it's just misting once or twice a week as needed. Keep them at room temperature. Let them have the seasonal sways and changes and whatnot with temperature. And that the seasonal changes is what triggers uh, breeding behavior. Cool. If, if they get a little bit warm, totally fine. If they get a little bit cold, also fine. So they are handleable, but I'd suggest keeping it at a minimum and also always using gloves because of those toxins that they secrete. What's the danger to like my dog, my cat, if my millipedes get out? I don't think it'd be a, a good thing. So keep your dogs and cats away <laughs> from the millipedes. And so making sure that you have a lid on the enclosure is probably pretty yes, wise definitely. in that regard. Is there opportunities to keep millipedes with some other animals or is that uh, kind of frowned upon? It's definitely doable. As long as uh, the millipede is big enough that like it won't fit in the mouth of the animal. Suggestions would be like crested geckos, dark frogs, uh, green anoles, mm -hmm. uh, smaller, smaller species. Cool, cool, cool.